Hello everyone, this is Teacher Juvie and I will be your guide for today's lesson. Let's discuss comparison and arrangement of decimal numbers. There are three ways in comparing decimal numbers. So using a number line for a small scale, Difference between numbers and place value chart for numbers that cannot be represented in a number line. And the third way is by adding zero to evenly make the digits of decimal numbers. Look at the given decimals and use the place value chart to find the smallest and the largest value. So we have the given decimals. And these are 3 and 756 thousands, 37 and 56 hundredths, 375 and 6 tenths, and 3,756 ten thousands. So we're going to use the place value chart para ma-determine natin yung mga place value ng bawat digits sa mga given decimal numbers. So, the first one is 3 and 756 thousands. So, the, play, uh, the whole number here is 3. Then, followed by decimal point and the decimal places were 756 uh, thousands. Then, 37 and 56. So, the whole number here is 37 and yung mga decimal places naman o yung mga digit na nasa decimal places ay 5 and 6. Then, 375 and 6 tenths. So, 375 yung whole number and yung decimal places is 6. Then, uh, 3,756 ten thousands. So, wala siyang whole number at meron siyang 4 decimal places. So, here are the questions. What is the smallest decimal? So, from the given decimal numbers or set of decimal numbers, ang pinakamaliit na decimal ay ang 3,756 ten thousands kasi wala naman siyang whole number. Then, what is the largest decimal? So, the largest decimal is 375 and 6 tenths dahil siyang may pinakamalaking whole number, 375. So, when we arrange the numbers in ascending and descending order, so, kailangan alam na natin ang meaning ng ascending at descending order. Dito kasi, hirap ng bata, nalilito sila kung ano ba yung ascending and descending. So, para maunawaan natin, pag sinabing ascending order, so, we arrange the numbers from least to greatest. So, mula sa maliit hanggang sa papalaki or malaking number. Then, kabalik tara naman ng ascending and descending order, which we arrange the numbers from greatest to least. So, from malaki naman hanggang pa paliit. So, that's how we arrange decimal numbers in ascending and descending order. Okay, so let's try this activity. Arrange the given decimals in ascending order. So, what is ascending order? We arrange the decimals from least to greatest. So, when we arrange uh, decimals, we have to compare every digits ng mga decimals na yan. So, we compare the digits from left to right. Kasi yung left, yung whole numbers, hanggang sa pinakamaliit na place value ng decimal number. Okay, so, since ang kanyang whole number ay 0, proceed tayo sa tenths place. So, 0, 0, 0, Tsaka 0. So, same sila na ang digit sa tens place ay 0. So, move tayo sa hundreds place. 9, 1, 0, 1. So, ang pinakamaliit sa apat na decimal number ay 0. Itong 89, 10,000. So, so, siya yung pinaka una sa order. So, 89, 10,000 ang pinaka least among the given decimal numbers. Okay, so next naman, proceed tayo sa susunod sa 89 ten thousands na maliit. So, let's compare again the digits of the given decimal. So, start tayo from the tenths place. So, 0, 0, okay, 0. 
Next is hundreds place, 9, 1, and 1. So, tie ang 12 thousands at 189 ten thousands sa uh, hundreds place, pareho ang digit nila ay 1. So, move tayo. I-compare na lang natin itong 12 thousands at itong 189 ten thousands. So, compare natin yung kanyang thousands place, 2 and 8. So, obviously, ang 12 thousands or yung 2 doon sa 12 thousands ay mas maliit kumpara doon sa 189 ten thousands. So, ang second natin sa order ay ang 12 thousands. Then, cross out na natin yung number. Okay, so we have two decimal numbers left, yung 900 and 189 ten So, let's compare the digits. Punahin natin ay yung uh, tens place. So, they both have zero dun sa tens place. Proceed tayo sa hundreds place. So, this is 9 and this is 1. So, obviously, kita naman na 9 is greater than 1. Therefore, ang 189 ten thousands ay mas maliit kumpara sa 9 hundreds. Kaya siya ang pangatlo sa ating ascending order. Cross out na natin ang 189 ten thousands. And yung ating greatest decimal number sa ating set of given numbers ay ang 9 Hundreds. So, ang ating order ngayon of decimals in ascending order is 89 ten thousands, 12 thousands, 189 ten thousands, and 9 hundreds. In comparing decimals, we use the symbols less than, greater than, and equal to compare decimals as shown below. When comparing two decimals, it is helpful to write and uh, to write one below the other. This is shown in the given example. An example in comparing decimal numbers, which is greater, 58 and 23 hundredths or 49 and 35 hundredths. So let's write the given decimals, 58 and 23 hundredths and 49 and 35 hundredths. The given decimals have whole number parts, so we compare whole number parts only. In 58 and 23 hundredths, the whole number part is 58, while in 49 and 35 hundredths, the whole number part is 49. So obviously, 58 is greater than 49. Therefore, Fifty-eight and twenty-three hundreds is greater than forty-nine and thirty-five hundreds. So we use greater than symbol. Okay, so let's try to solve this problem. Team Nara and Team Mahogany underwent a water challenge. Their task was to transfer the water in a cup from the first player to the tenth player without spilling within the allotted time. After the task, the team captain measured the water collected using a measuring cup. Team Nara collected 1 and 402 thousand liters, while Team Mahogany collected 1 and 45 thousand liters of water. Which team got more water? So let's show the solution to the problem. So we have Team Nara and Team Mahogany. Team Nara collected 1 and 402,000 liters of water, while Team Mahogany collected 1 and 45,000 liters of water. So from the given decimals, they have whole number parts. So we compare whole number parts only. In 1 and 402,000, and 1 and 45 thousands, the whole number part is both 1. So, we compare the tens place. So, ibig sabihin, magpo-proceed tayo sa tens place since ang kanilang whole number ay parehong 1. Okay, so proceed tayo sa kanilang tens place. So, ang digit sa tens place ng Team Nara is 4, while the digit in the tens place sa Team Mahogany is 0. Obviously, 4 is greater than 0. Therefore, ang 1 and 402 thousands is greater than 1 and 45 thousands. So, the answer to the problem is 
Team Nara got more water than Team Mahogany. Okay, so here are the important notes in comparing and arranging decimals. Comparing and arranging decimals are some of the techniques to determine the value of the given decimals. So, isa yung way para malaman natin yung value ng given decimals. Okay, so when you compare numbers, first look at the number of digits in each number. Then compare the place values of the numbers with the same amount of digits. Thanks for watching this video. Hit like if you learned from this video and don't forget to subscribe on my channel. Thank you so much!